We're back, big game today. Ipswich, everyone's saying it should be an easy game, but uh, Ipswich got some good players. Um, got Rory Delap, uh, sorry, Liam Delap, Rory Delap's uh, son, good striker. Got Leith Davis, potential uh, England left back. Amari Hutchinson, who was a big, big signing for them, good player. Um, Jack Clark making his comeback. And of course, Kieran McKenna, who uh, used to be at Spurs as a player and had to stop his career. Came back and uh, got Spurs to the uh, semi-finals of the Youth Cup, around 2015, something like that. Um, but we should have too much for them today. Hopefully, um, hopefully Romero's back. I heard Timo Werner could be in the stadium. I, I'm not sure if that's 100% correct. But um, we should have too much for them. But they played well um, in Switch in most of their games, although they've only got five points. Um, we should have too much for them today. So I'm going to go for a... Uh, a free one win. Um, hopefully, uh, I would have gone for a three nil win, but um, the fact that I don't know who's uh, starting just yet means that uh, I'm going to go three one. And uh, be nice to see uh, Solanke carrying on in his winning scoring uh, run, and maybe Brendan Johnson get one. So let's go and let's try and get in that top four before the international break. Please don't, Doctor Tottenham. Please don't turn up. Come on, you Spurs. Got what we deserve today. Absolutely shocking. Shocking. Every single time nah, we have an international there, break, we get beat. Yeah. I said that uh, Ipswich and McKenna had good players and good coach. Hits on the counter attack. Play deep. Hits that. The lap caused problems at the back. Amari Hutchinson, I said before the game, is a top player. You know, paid 25 million for him. At least they ID some proper talent. I mean, he was causing us problems all the time. He's running, even in the 90th minute, he was still running us ragged. I don't know where, I don't know what else to say about today's game. Benton Cord tried his best at the base. Dragusin wasn't having a good game. But it's just, we're clueless at the, uh, when they lie deep, low block and uh, get hit on the counter-attack. We had chances, but not enough of them. Not enough of them for a team line where they are in the league. Really, really, really disappointed. Just have the same feeling every time we go into an international break that we let it slip. Chance to go top four. Forest losing, and we end up with that performance. Absolutely shambolic. Anyway, going into the break. Hopefully we'll come back without so many injuries. Come in, you suppose. 